<laughs> hey there everybody, we're seeing the whole universe, hope everything is fine and I'm a Russian man who brings value to my own experience and today we're going to talk about the life and the going forward, again motivational talk speech and something like this way my spiel to encourage you to go forward, to be positive, to be a lot of like a happy Hufflepuff man, I don't know, Hufflepuff is good to say, and yes it is good, okay let's accept it. And. Uh, as you know, I'm from Podolsk. It is Moscow district. It is the Russian Federation. And it is the interesting district because in Russia, I want to talk about the Russia right now, that uh, we have two points in Russia, Moscow and St. Petersburg. Something else, it is like another country. I want to say maybe the same with New York and maybe something like Arkansas and uh, Arkansas places like cities and provinces of your city like inside of it you will find something like even in New York uh, New York State but in New York City it is one thing but something like uh, except of New York City city in I mean in New York City that it will be something even different you maybe understand it or maybe you are living right now in a Delhi of uh, of India and it is something around of it and uh, let's talk about the provinces provinces it is interesting and uh, I think that we have it is good that they are not super populated a lot that they are not super with a high technology we should love it and I want to say my benefits for it because uh, you understand that uh, if you are from province, it means that it is healthier, in the meaning of ecology, at least. Because you can look around and it is a really healthy place to live and a lot of forests, maybe rivers around you, maybe something like this. And uh, you don't have super mega skyscrapers all around and you don't have this kind of uh, factories or something like this. You are free here and a lot of... Uh, Free oxygen is around, it is a good thing. Yes, you can say that, uh, hey, what the hell, I don't have all the opportunities that I could have in another country and uh, in another city. And uh, you can say it this way. I don't know what, uh, what was the accent. Firstly, I thought that it was uh, kind, of, <laughs> kind of Indian, but then it went to the places of kind of, I don't know, Indonesian <laughs> or something like it, it was a mix of accents uh, don't need to say that this uh, some spe specific nation if you are a accent master then let me know what accent i was speaking a few seconds ago it was uh, like a mix of sweden plus this and okay and uh, you understand that about, about Russia, let's go to talk, that uh, in Podolsk we have a lot of uh, opportunities uh, to go to Moscow. You can go to Moscow like one hour, but here is a lot of uh, different places of uh, breathing, bre breathing, really. In Moscow we don't have this opportunity to breathe freely, more free than uh, we have here. And uh, if I will go some, somewhere like Yekaterinburg, or St. Petersburg, then it will be even more like freedom of breath. Okay, I said about it a lot. And uh, about the opportunities of money. Really, we don't have super a lot of opportunities to work somewhere. In Podolsk, yes, we have, we can go to Moscow, it is good. But what about the districts and what about the cities that are kind of like you could, Yekaterinburg and uh, other places like oblasts. Oblast it is the district or the area, area of the city that it is near the place. Yekaterinburg it is uh, some good city in Russia, but uh, if we will dive into the districts that are near the Yekaterinburg, it will be really like I'm in the forest, nobody's here and uh, it is like jobs for Nine, uh, for 9 to 15,000 rubles. As you know, uh, as uh, maybe you are not familiar with it, if, if you are not familiar with it, 9 to 15 thousands of rubles, it is, uh, you even uh, will not buy a food. You, you, yes, you will, but your money will be fully on food, and that's all. It is uh, like when I was living, if you want to eat healthy in uh, our city in our Russia, then you need kind of tw 12 thousands. 
it uh, not depends on city because uh, it is inflation for everything for every region yes some south parts could be easier for veggies and for carrots and for yes veg, veggies and fruits but uh, actually all the products we buy them uh, for the same the same price and if you want to eat healthy it will be from 7000 to 12000 rubles thousands rubles for you it will be till 200 dollars $200 you need uh, to eat uh, good and healthy in Russia. Ish. It is really hugely ish. It means that uh, $1 is uh, 70 and uh, se 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 70 times uh, 200 you understand that this 14,000 and uh, it is hugely rough, roughly ish. And uh, it is interesting really how they live in their their places because uh, in our places like near Moscow and uh, near the, the Moscow Moscow districts people are saying like oh Jesus it's not really good to live in our countries and uh, in our country and they are kind of claiming and blaming and uh, saying not uh, really good words to the political things and uh, they are really sometimes doing it but what about the districts that are kind of somewhere else it's not about politics even, it is about uh, kind of... Yes, it is about, and it's the same it's not about, my talk not about it. And uh, it's really interesting, because how do they live? Need to communicate with people from these regions? Yes, I was communicating, and some people... Right now we have opportunities to, to do internet things. It is, thank you for it. Because you can work from every part of the world. If you have a computer or maybe you have a phone, then you can do anything. At least if you have a computer. Yes, uh, phone will help you too, but computer it will be better. Because uh, you can do kind of programming stuff and programming coding, you can find up work jobs and something like this anywhere. And uh, they are freelance and if you know English. So if you are from another city, then you can survive through learning English, through learning another different languages and uh, go to Upwork and then you can work there for someone who is from foreign countries because uh, for freelance in Russia you will not get a lot of uh, a lot of dough and dinero because uh, in Russia freelance this kind of yes it is uh, it is painful too but if we will compare it revenue from Upwork from other countries is bigger four times five times sometimes for example in in a way of voice acting our Russian freelance voice acting will cost for you 250 rubles for from abroad it will be 1500 rubles compare it it is uh, six six times bigger okay it is our talk about money I, I don't know what is it good to talk about it or not? It is kind of, again, inside of me, something like sometimes some voices from someone else. Like, we have a lot of uh, opinions around the world that speaking about this topic is good. Or speaking about this topic is bad. And all the time you can hear these words from anyone. Really. You can hear... Like, not anyone actually, but again, I right now speak in a way of the commenter who can write for me. And uh, you can hear it, uh, we have a lot of people around the world, everybody has uh, their own perspective on things, and uh, everybody, want, can, everybody can say that, nope, you was not right here, but you were not right here, and he maybe will be right, because he has a bigger experience in this field. And sometimes I'm uh, kind of scared to say these words or something like this because I want to actually I want to help to anybody to anyone in this world but if you want to help to anyone then you should say only word love that's all love to you love to you love to you okay that's all uh, but uh, if I will create videos only by saying love to you it will be kind of Yes, some people will follow me, but uh, Jesus Christ, you want to find something else. And maybe I said everything by this phrase.
I mean that uh, not a phrase. Uh, I feel a little bit of shy because of the people around me. By the way, they are from my region, from my district. And this kind of feeling of some people who can say to you rude words too. Sometimes I think about uh, opinions of others, sometimes I don't. But mostly I think in a, in a good way. In a good way, yes. Because I understand that maybe it will hurt their feelings and uh, that I speak this way. And actually I will not hurt. Uh, sometimes, sometimes I think in the meaning of... Yes, I can say phrases in English. And if they are bombed to me, like and said, uh, why are we speaking English in Russia? Then actually it's not my fault. Actually it's mine. But uh, we can look at through the perspective that the reason that they bombed, the, they are the reason, not I am. I am too. Yes, we are both. Because we are in this world. And it is interesting, really. Maybe no need to give a damn about it. Then, then, okay, <laughs> it is uh, continuing. If I will not give a damn about them, then why should I give a damn about anyone in this world? Really? And, uh, okay, then, okay, let's go. I will care about my family. And about the loved ones and who are near me, close to me. Okay, someone can say, why are you doing something like uh, for them, but not for the world? Because we live in the world. Are you not caring about the world? Maybe you next uh, day will be going to like uh, broke, the egg, <laughs> broke the trees and uh, using your axe and uh, kill the animals. It's not really good. And uh, sometimes these questions are inside of my mind, but actually I understand that my meta, meta message in any video, any type of video, super mega any, even for the super like a dummies and he, I'm, I'm not super smart person for, for this type of people. I mean that not the type of, uh, you maybe understand, super like low level class jokes and something like this about penises and something. I, I appreciate it too. I like it and uh, because it is uh, like jokes about the world. Okay, it's fun. And in the same time, uh, <laughs> I don't know. Actually, it is kind of the balance should be. It is the, why do I feel it? Because uh, I don't know why. Maybe I can say because of my uh, huge amount of viewers from Russia, huge amount of people, it is the kind of feeling when you should be accountable for you, what you're saying and I became super accountable for everything that I say. Maybe it is good. Maybe it's not. In the meaning that uh, these thoughts are appearing inside of my mind. Sometimes uh, I have a thought. It's only a thought in the meaning of the... It's only a thought in the meaning of... Uh, Jesus Christ, some, some girls are walking around with us. And uh, it's only a thought in the meaning of uh, well, marketing. It's uh, better to be kind of stupid. It's uh, better to be dumb. It's better. Because you are, don't give a damn about anything that's happening around you. You are like, oh, okay, it's fine. I can be, I can be in this field too. Because uh, it is kind of mental switch inside my mind. And it's a huge balance. Sometimes I should uh, balance it. And at the same time, when I do kind of switch, someone can say to me, why are you not sincere? Why are you doing it? And at the same time, I want to kind of uh, to feel free and something like this. And maybe the main message should be about that uh, I want to be happy and uh, other people maybe want to and that's why we do what we do and we do because we want to be happy and uh, other people should be doing the same 
yes sometimes it is super life is super easy and in the same time we can look at this uh, at the hard thing because you should count everything that happening but actually life is easy life is super easy super easy really how it constructed it is sounds it is uh, video if you can see it is all about our organs of uh, how we understand it and then we kind of measure it inside of our mind it's easy easy part next uh, it is about the like speaking with others actually if you bring value to other people then everything is easy too but someone will say to you that uh, not okay don't think about it Igor I mean think about it but focus on other things yes it is what should be it's the answer it's the answer guys I remember sometimes I speak even that I prefer to invest my time in something it is the best phrase that I can bring to you. For example, I prefer... Yes, we have 24 hours in a day. And I prefer to invest my time into drawing, for example. Yes, it is a good phrase. It's amazing, super amazing phrase. Because you will not say something rude to another person. I love everything, but I... Uh, and I love everything, but not but but I, I love everything and I like to invest my time into drawing or into, into music stuff. It will be the best quote. Yes, yes. Because we should love everything in our life because we are made by it and we feel really happy. At least I feel happy when I love everything what's happening. But I prefer and I prefer and I prefer invest my time in something like this, in this direction, okay? I think it is the best quest, the, the best quest, and quest too, the best quote that we can create. I prefer to invest my time in this field. And you are not saying a rude words to another person because you are preferring it and kind of we are free to say this. And in the same time you are focusing yourself in these directions. I. I remember how I started to use this phrase maybe from 2016 or 2015 or 2017 in this period of times that preferring because you need to set goals and if you want to set goals you can use different semantics like sacrifice time from something it is a good uh, way to say it too and uh, the most positive one it will be for I prefer to use I prefer to go to this direction to that direction it will be the most positive for like how people hear it i think it's the best okay thank you a lot for watching this video i hope you enjoyed this video and uh, let's go forward to our dreams i will go to showmanship through the programming through the writing through music through different stuff that happening in our world through brainstorming through professions i like professions by the way i like my life i love that you are watching me and i love myself and i love you and i love this world and by saying it i mainly i love the world i love you in this world i love myself in this world good <laughs> thank you a lot see you next time in personal daily bye bye